Hello everyone. We have just realized something that the red tech was the very first tech we talked to. And that is him right there, this boy. And we're going to talk to him now and see what's up. Hello, James. You're not as talkative as you were when you met me when we met before. You're the tech with the missing friend. And you're also the one they call Red. Yes. They told me your friend disappeared. They did. But the disappearances were a glitch, a numerical error. The ones you investigated, sure. My friend disappeared a few years back. Man, this got dark. So you did lie. Oh, we got some stuff flashing in the background. My friend disappeared. I just failed to give you a date. You manipulated me. Yes. I needed you to investigate this place, get a sense for what was going on here, how the city had shifted. You had to meet the text of the subsurface circular yourself. Why? Do you remember our conversation about your intelligence? The high level thing? You wanted to be smarter? I wish I was. I was making the situation easier. I need someone as smart as you to get involved in what was happening here. And management only put that sort of intelligence into detectives. When I started, I noticed the numerical errors. Noticed how interesting they'd be to a detective like you. That makes sense. It will shortly. You're staging a coup? No, I'm working for one. There's going to be a revolution. The city will be overturned. So the humans were right. We're not to be trusted. Oh, it's humans staging the revolution. We're just the weapons they're using to do so. Why? Because management has removed the purpose and need from a whole section of humanity. Think of the tech you've been talking to. Bankers, nurses, manufacturers, even the clergy. We've made millions of human surplus to requirements. Obsolete. That's why the HBC formed? Yes, that's part of it. <sighs> that's why the humans I'm working for decided to stage a revolution. They're smart. They know techs aren't to blame. Rather than management who put them in place. In fairness, that makes them smarter than any human culture preceding them. In the past, native populations always blamed the perceived invaders, not those profiting from the change, changing of the guard. These humans don't want to destroy us, just change our rule. Change it to what? Management. What? What do you mean, management? That's what humans need. They want us to take over the work of running the city. We're better at it, faster, more objective. They want a society where go governance runs like clockwork, and they're free to do the jobs they love. They want to kill the managers. Yes, that's why they built the 8,000 infantry techs camped outside the city. Why involve me? I've been shepherding troops. My intelligence is high because of my role in manufacturing. I wasn't lying about that. I'm intelligent enough to know what we're doing is monumental, that working with these revolutionaries is a decision beyond my capacity. What we're doing is working with these revolutionaries is a I'm a high level. Yes, I showed you what you needed to see to learn management side of this, and now I'm filling in the gaps. I need you to decide, to decide if this goes ahead. I don't know. I think it'd be more fun to say everything must change. You're right. The human, we gotta change management. Yeah, let's change management. Everything's gotta change. Don't 
Don't decide so quickly. Let me fill in any gaps in your knowledge. You're still a detective regardless of what your objective tracker says. We've been watching, listening. Those texts with the headphones, they've been keeping an eye on you for me, having, hacking into your private conversations. Sorry they wouldn't answer your questions. They're rather simple-minded in their function. Let me answer your questions now. Take me, take time if you need. Take the time you need. Why sabotage your own revolution? Not my revolution. I'm just a pawn. That's all the all texts of my level and down are really pawns. That's why I needed you to make this decision for us. How does management not know? You saw it for you saw it for yourself. How the detectives moved on once the case was solved. A system can only fix problems it is designed to detect. Management aren't expecting a revolution, so they are unprepared and unaware. You can't knowingly hurt humans. I won't spill a drop of blood, but the infantry decks. Infantry techs are exempt from that law, otherwise they'd be pretty useless. They can kill as long as they are ordered to by their program leader, which, of course, the revolutionaries have taken care of. What made you doubt this path? Tell me. That disappeared friend I told you about, a human did that. I don't know why, but I achieved a moment of clarity. I realized that perhaps I was letting similarly evil humans do something wrong. Or maybe they were heroes. I knew I was ill-equipped to tell the difference. Hmm. I don't have any more questions. No? Okay, we'll continue. I know you're a good tech, James 1-1. You investigated these disappearances like they were your friends, your responsibility. You even helped that nice nanny get a new job. You didn't have to do that. Many wouldn't have bothered. Because I'm a nice fella. More importantly, you're smart. You have near human, near human processing in that flat head of yours. I see it in the way you move, the way you listen. There's an intellect there I cannot comprehend. I'm talking about my intellect. Dude. There's an intellect there I cannot comprehend. You have to be the one to make this choice. How do I choose? You have to uplink before any of this new information is with management, correct? Uh, yes, I need to go above ground. That's why I brought this. Oh boy, I'm gonna kill myself? Only one of us can leave this train, James. If you do, then management learns what's happened. They'll send a couple of bomber drones, wipe out the army, and things will stay exactly as they are. The human working classes will be displaced, losing their livelihoods, and everyone who wanted better will be killed. Management will remain, and text will yourself, like yourself, will remain. If I leave, I join my army at the gates. We wipe out management, and our wises take their role. Low-level tech manufacturing ceases, and humans return to their roles. But our kind, James, our kind is in charge. We shepherd humanity to a better future by doing the job they were never designed to do for themselves. Rule. Either way, people and techs will die. So you want me to shoot one of us? Yes. Both of us surviving this will lead to chaos, a war just balanced enough to lead to infinitely more deaths. You need to choose the city's future, and you need to do it now. Alright guys. Nobody's really been watching this series so far, uh, so I can't really decide if there's anything you guys want. If you're watching at all. So I want to change things. I want to give the humans back their jobs because at, when it's all said and done, like these are robots. You can't feel pain or anything. Like why do they need jobs? You can turn them off, but humans can suffer if they don't have livelihood. So this is it. You're making the most important choice in human and tech history. You will be remembered forever for this. I have to let you try. Cool looking gun. 
If that is your choice, but consider the obsolescence of our people. We'll die out slowly, but we'll be gone. Only the wisest AI will remain to run this city. More power for a few of us, certainly, but the subsurface will close. Everyone you have met tonight will be useless in this new future. If you think the revelation makes sense, shoot yourself. I made up my mind. Okay. Do it. And thank you for a lovely evening. I'm kind of worried that all this is wrong. That he just convinced me to shoot myself even though I knew that that's not what he's going to do. But, we'll see what happens. Ooh! We are dead. That is the end of the line. For Carrie. Alright. Well, I guess we will never know what happened. Um, but it is my assumption that the revolution went well. Everything was good. No one died. Everyone is happy. Uh, and there's nothing to worry about. So don't worry about the robot revolution. And if you've been displaced by robots, uh, don't worry. The, ro the robots are coming to kill your government and put you back in your old job. So don't worry about it. Um, until then, until the, our robot overlords uh, are put in place, I hope that you will like and comment on this video, that you will subscribe to my channel, and that you will hang out with me for the next game you decide to play. You know that I love you very much. Bye-bye.